Hey guys, this is JV. Welcome to my YouTube channel. In today's video, we are going to talk about the Puppet Warp tool. It's a really fun tool to use. So let's get started. Let's start by duplicating the layer and then selecting the subject. Go to Select and Mask. Click on Select Subject. And then use the Refine Edge Brush tool to clean the edges. Click on OK. Now Ctrl plus click on the layer mask to make a selection. And then go to Select modify expand now click on the original layer and then select content aware fill select the area you can also click on the auto button hit ok Now merge the bottom two layers. Convert the layer to smart object. Go to edit puppet warp. Click anywhere to define points. I like to define all the joints at first. Now click on any point, hold ALT and now you can rotate the point. But as you can see, it's not doing its job properly. That's because there's another point defined that is restricting the movement. To delete a point, just hold ALT and click on the point. You can also click and drag a point like this. Let's move the head a bit and the other arm too. Now you need to be very careful with the adjustments you make with the Puppet Warp tool because as soon as you make major change then it starts to look a bit funny like this. Use Puppet Warp tool for minor adjustments only. You can turn on and off the eye icon on the effect to see what changes you made. And that's it guys. I hope you guys like this video. Don't forget to leave a like and a comment down below and subscribe for some awesome tutorials every week. I'll see you guys in the next video.